Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. Today I'm, is. I'm so proud of my mom. She took her own shoes. <laughs> I feel like a lot of you guys appreciate the fact oh, that I'm not the brightest, brightest bulb in I, the ceiling. No, I always say the I store. Always... Sophie and I have the same cheap Crocs for the, around the barn. You can tell them apart. Yours are like. Western Longer color. Anyway, welcome to today and thank you for accepting me for who I am and thank you for being proud of me for getting the right shoes, Sophie. That's amazing. and it is our first riding lesson back at our lesson barn so we'll so we will be hauling in storm is happy to have his shelter back the grass is growing so fast right now we can't even keep up with it look they did such a good job look how much they've eaten Look at Chino's ready to come. Chino. Come on, Chino. Chino. Girls are hanging tough today, saying you guys can walk to me. Yay! Putting our life in boxes, erasing the memory so you won't notice. I'm taking the time to focus. You're by yourself, I'm by myself. Wish I could solve your problems They're stuck on my wall like neon paintings And I'm so tired of being honest To everyone but myself I do it so well We were so good at flying But we can't keep flying We keep getting stuck on the wrong side of the mountain We were so good at trying But we can't keep trying a difference but I'm very impressed at how much grass they've eaten the plan is to leave them in each paddock for two weeks and make a third paddock at the back there and I was like there's no way they're gonna eat all this grass in two weeks but they're gonna eat all this grass in two weeks uh, if you do it in two week intervals then they say that the grass has time to grow again which is super awesome so we're at two hours next week we'll start three hours it's gonna take us a while to get them on the grass full-time when we saw the signs we just kept dancing in the night so it seemed so endless thought it would last now it's in the past we were so good at flying but we can't keep flying we keep getting stuck on the wrong side of the mountain we were so good at trying because they're only in the field such a short time we don't have a water container in here i definitely think now that they're up to two hours they need it i think that now that they are in this field for two hours, they definitely need water. Something's happening. Gabby, come here, she's caught maybe. It's okay, Molly, help me get this up. I can't lift this up. Help me get this up. stuck. <sighs> Freaking out, help me up, so I can't get it. I have my left hand, that's the problem. This door is so heavy. Oh, actually, let's put it back down now because we're gonna be. We already loaded it. You already loaded it. Oh, scared. Well, she sure called. Called wolf. Holy cow. Ruby's like, I'm getting the heck out of here. Ruby. Oh, I would love to see Hendrix. I would love to see Hendrix too. Let's go see if it's him. She's shaking, something happened. I don't know what it was. All of a sudden she just started screaming, like a hurt scream. My heart is racing too. What were you thinking? Mm, she's just caught. She, I thought maybe she was stuck. She's gotta have she the was, col collar on. She has the collar on. We need to go get her a breakaway collar maybe. 
Are you okay? Is, is anything get hurt? <laughs> no, she wasn't stuck. She just was afraid for some reason. Yeah. She's entered the the scared Probably stage. Probably a snake. Maybe a snake bitter. Oh, I'd scream too if a snake. Well, Maybe look. Maybe a snake bitter. There's no way a snake bitter. You know what I what I was thinking? Don't what? you dare lift that up because I thought like she got stuck. Yeah, like, when you start lifting it up, she screamed louder, and I was like, oh, she might be caught on the bottom of that. Oh, yeah, my gosh. you're lifting her up, breaking her neck. Well, I saw her first before I lifted it up. I saw her come over to the one side, so I knew she was okay. All right, let's go see if Hendrix is here. A lot of you guys suggested that we write uh, on a whiteboard to keep the chores fair in the barn. I was so impressed with you guys. Such a good idea. Hi, princess. Love this girl. Like, I came in the barn last night, you guys didn't see. I came in here and I was just sitting here waiting for Sam to go get me gas for the pressure washer. And I just, she just comes in and literally stood beside me, just hung out with me. She's amazing. I love this pony so much. So, I took you guys up on your suggestions and I got a whiteboard. I haven't filled it in yet, but we did have a big long discussion about um, division of chores this morning and how we could make it more work efficient for us. And we did. We, we did it, you guys. So, uh, Sam came down with the girls this morning. There's more talker in there. And how, yeah. and how it's going to work is that Gabby will clean her two stalls, Sophie will clean her stall and the arena because the ponies go to the bathroom in the arena at night. So it's like two stalls. She'll be doing like the uh, ponies and her horse. And then they will each make grain for the next day for their own horse. So this is how it is, you guys. This is how it is. P ponies to the left and horses to the right. You know what I really, really, really want to do? Get a new kitten. I already have one. Mm -hmm. He's still coming. Why do I want to stick it? Oh, um, I don't know. Your your dog is. Oh, this. I want to go to a show with Willow. I want us to too. I don't know if there's going to be any shows, but you need to practice her line driving today. She'd be getting so fat because she doesn't have enough exercise. That's why I'm playing with her today. Ruby's like, let me play, Ruby. I can do that. Good girl. Your pony's not too forward. See? Gracie's like, if you want to canter, I'll show you canter. My pony's more forward. Yeah. My pony's lazy. Yeah. <laughs> Own it. We got lazy you ponies. Know we're, both la we're both lazy. Yeah, and that's okay. We're working on it, right? We believe that everybody has issues in their life. Everybody has things to work on and the first stage of working on them is owning it and that's okay. Uh, life is a progress, it's a process and we just gotta do better today than we did yesterday. I feel like sometimes I have so much going on that I just can't keep it all straight in this little tiny head. I have a small head. Same, but you're a genius. We should take a test. <laughs> Okay. Uh, Hogwarts house you're in. Oh. <laughs> I thought you meant like an IQ test. No, I would have zero. No, you're really smart, Gabby. So the thing about the puppy is that she's genius. Like she is, you teach her something and then like we taught her off the couch and literally she's so good. Like she tries to get up there and I'm like off and she's like, oh, I forgot. I'm so sorry. She knows off now really well. Down and you stare at your window, hoping that you'll come up with some words to say. That's not okay. When you feel like you're fed up with heartbreak, and you know that you can't take another day. Well, that's not okay.
Holy heck, like a jungle to the pool. It's been so rainy and yuck the last few days and the weather's been cold that we haven't been down to the pool. And yeah, I need to get out here and cut the grass. Watch, oh my goodness, even the girls' field is a jungle. Pool as clear as can be, mostly. Um, so you guys might have seen in the last video, Sam got a new pump for it and he needs to hook it up, but today he had to go and work on the trailer and then we have to drive in for lessons and then tomorrow he works. You guys know the drill. It's gonna take a while, but by the weekend, I'm sure he'll get the pump back on. We'll get the pool back in action. And I really think that because we have so much metal in our water, then when we add chlorine, that's what makes it turn green. Okay. nervous about all the stuff that's gonna happen today at driving in for lessons it's gonna be a whole new thing you guys know lessons opened last week here and it looks different for people riding lesson horses than it does for people driving in so we have like a bunch of rules we can't go into the arena we're riding outside I think we can't go outside yeah fun not that I don't trust them but I do like to check and make sure they have everything update on Sophie's green mint saddle pads. You might know that we ordered these saddle pads for our kids for Easter and um, we ordered the mint one from the Lemieux company. We ordered the, the citron one from a local company and the Lemieux company sent it to our old address. Even though Sam changed the address, they sent it to our old address. So, uh, we're not getting it. Not only are we not getting it, but they don't have it in stock anymore. So I have to talk to Sophia and see if she wants to pick a different color or wait. I don't know what will happen. Gabby has a plan for loading the horses, so we're just gonna follow along. got water to take with us it's hot outside I don't know if we're having lessons outside or if we're having lessons inside I'm hoping outside I know that we're allowed lessons inside now as long as we follow the rules I am gonna try and wrangle myself some ponies Hey, sweet pony. Look at that, I just have to stand here and she comes right to me. Good girl. She doesn't understand this, but she's going in a stall. You're going in a stall. All right, well now I have a problem because even though I was so brave and good and amazing, I wrangled myself this pony. This pony wants to come. Don't even think about fighting with her. Don't even think about fighting with her. Not when I'm standing here. Okay, why do I even bother? Honestly, don't even think about it. I'm doing it the lazy way. Close that door and then I'll just let the ponies in because they want to come in already. Sophie wants to ride Finn in her lesson today, but we have to bring Finn back into work. Yeah. Look how gorgeous that color is. He's gorgeous. So she, she can't ride him even though she wants to. And she wants to be the one to bring him back into work. So you're going to ride him tonight? <laughs> Uh, Gabby's gonna ride him first when we get home. Come on in. Come on in. I probably won't ride when we get home. See, she's like, I'm going in. Walk Willow that. actually really. Walk that. Oh, don't go in there. Willow actually really loves this stall. Pick one. Oh gosh. Ooh, she says another boy. She must be in heat because she, normally she's oblivious and couldn't care less. Do they have water? Does she have water? Let me see. Yeah. So Finny's staying in here and he's gonna have lunch. We're gonna ride you when we get back, so don't get crazy. And the ponies are gonna stay here and keep him company. Keep him company. And as you saw them beating me down to get in here, they both want to. They want to be in. All right, let's water. go. I miss, water? yeah, oh. Yeah, they have water. No, did you get the water for us. Oh yeah, where's the water? I have one for Fiona too. Who knows long, how long she's been teaching. 
All right, we're here. We're back in our lesson barn. Uh, so all the rules are different. We have to tack up at our trailer just as though we were going to a show. You know how you like tack up at your trailer? So we're gonna do that and then they're gonna come out and get us when it's our turn, when it's our time. I think Gabby's gonna go first and then Sophie, but I don't know, we'll have to see what Fiona says when she gets here. Gabby's Everybody's getting skinny in quarantine and I'm just getting fatter. Gabby found her child. She calls him her child. No, because Sophia was right close so, to him. I'm like, come here, baby. And he comes to me and stuff. So cool. Then I picked I him up. Hey, baby. He's in the way and I can't get the house. Okay, Gabby has to go up and shower so that she can be ready for pizza. We came home from riding and supper was the first thing on the girls' agenda. That is it for today. Tomorrow, Gabby's gonna start Finn back in action. And I'm excited. The girls' riding lessons from today will start going up tonight. That is it for today. Remember, you are enough just the way you are. I'll see you guys tomorrow.